Today we're going to cover six easy title optimizations for Google Shopping from Omnitail. Product titles may seem easy, but there are actually a number of factors to consider when you write a product title. The platform you advertise on makes a big difference. A title on your website will look very different from the title for that same product on Amazon. Google Shopping is no different. So how can you write your product titles to get more clicks and drive conversions on Google Shopping? Here are six easy tips to do just that. One, part number and ASIN. Imagine you need a part for your car. It's probably pretty specific since your car has a certain make, year, manufacturer, and you wanna make sure you get the correct part. In this case, you might search for that car part using a product number. If you sell highly specialized products such as machinery, hospital equipment, or car parts, including a part number or ASIN can drastically increase your conversions. For products like these, shoppers are often searching the part number instead of the full product title. This is also important because if a query includes a part number, you know exactly which product they want to purchase. Make sure you get your products in front of these highly qualified shoppers by including the part number in your product titles. Two, synonyms. Not all shoppers use the same terms to search. For example, if you sell furniture and all of your products have sofa in the title, a shopper looking for a query with the word couch might miss out. Include synonyms where possible, like love seat sofa. Colors are another great opportunity to include synonyms. If you describe the sofa you're selling as mustard, you might also want to include yellow in the title, since the number of people looking for a yellow sofa is most likely higher than those looking for a mustard sofa. Include synonyms in your product title optimizations so that shoppers who are looking for your products but using different terminology don't miss out on your business. Three, color, size, gender, and age. These descriptors are often forgotten in titles, even if they're included elsewhere in the feed. These are especially important if you are selling clothing. While it might be obvious to you which color, size, gender, or age group the product is by looking at the picture you've included for your listing, the shopper can only qualify your product by their search terms initially. And Google relies on your product titles to determine where to serve ads. You risk losing impressions if these terms are not included in your title. Including these descriptors further qualifies the shopper's search as well. For example, if your product is titled Swimco's Blue Swimsuit, the product changes vastly with the addition of men's or women's. Including this key descriptor ensures your ad serves to the most relevant searchers. When it comes to age, you can identify the age by stating either men's women's versus girls boys, or you can use the term adult or youth. Four, differentiators. A common problem with vacuums is that the roller brush will get wrapped in hair. Vacuum sellers have started including no hair wrap or self-cleaning in their product titles to highlight this feature, a key differentiator. Differentiators are unique product features that set you apart from your competitors. They do not have to be proprietary and can just be features that help to further qualify your product for a searcher. More examples of value adds include terms such as hypoallergenic, organic, non-slip, stain resistant, waterproof, or 100% cotton. Differentiators are not features like free shipping that will be included elsewhere in your PLA or hyperbolic words like the best, the greatest, that don't add value to your listing. Five, product specific descriptors. In addition to differentiators, customers look for specific descriptors. For instance, shoppers looking for duvet covers often consider fill power when shopping. If you are listing duvet covers, then it would be important to include the parameter 700 fill power in the title. There is probably a similar descriptor for the product that you sell. Let's take a look at a few more examples. For skincare products, the size of the bottle is important to most shoppers. In this case, you would want to include milliliters in your title. For sandpaper, the level of grit is necessary. You could have anywhere between 40 and 60 grit, and different levels are for different purposes. 
Find out if the product you sell has any descriptors that are necessary for determining if your product is right for the shopper, and then add them to your listing. 6. Be specific. While on your website it's okay to have a more vague description of your product, on Google Shopping the title should be as specific as possible. On your website it might be appropriate to simply title your product with a flashy marketing name. For example, a retailer might sell grocery tote bags that they call the Simple Shopper. While this title might work for your website, where a user is more familiar with your product, this will not translate as well to Google Shopping. Someone searching for the term grocery tote bag or even reusable grocery bag is unlikely to be served the simple shopper because none of those words appear in the title. As we already touched on above, if you use an artistic color description such as winter or sunset, be sure to include the simple color title white or orange in your title as well. It's okay to use more descriptive color words, such as coral or turquoise. Just make sure these colors aren't eliminating shoppers, but instead resonating with the people you want to reach and allowing them to find your products. Final thoughts on Google Shopping title optimization. Your Google Shopping ad title length is 150 characters, but the visible character count is only 70. So choose the descriptors, synonyms, and values that make the most sense for your products. Don't waste this space. Errors in your product feed can cause titles, pictures, and web pages to not match. Combine these six tips for title optimization with our other tips for product feed optimization to ensure all of your products are serving. Thank you for watching. We hope this video helps you drive profit for your business. For more digital marketing tips from Omnitail, check out our other videos.